Lincoln can earn money in a variety of different ways. Everything from just taking out individual gangsters, you'll kind of get a money boost from that, to actually the process of unpicking the crime ecosystem in the city. Districts in the city are built up of criminal rackets. Uh, as Lincoln takes those down, he gets tip-offs on high-value targets. You can uh, interrogate people that will tell you where a different racket is storing all of its money. And so you can go after that one specific place where everyone stashed the money for the racket. And if you take that down, you'll get a huge amount of money. One of the great ways to uh, make more money is by recruiting racket bosses. If you've wiretapped that district enough, you're given the option whether to kill or recruit that racket boss. And if you kill that racket boss, you get, you know, a lower amount of money. But if you recruit that racket boss, you make a larger amount of money over a certain period of time. And so it really incentivizes recruiting as many racket bosses as you can instead of killing them. The hideouts themselves then start to generate earn. So over time, you get access to more and more cash and this allows Lincoln to upgrade his fleet. He can upgrade all of those vehicles. He can add performance uh, to them as the game progresses. There's different types of weaponry in the game that Lincoln can gain access to as well, ever more powerful stuff. Basic supplies, which you'll call in through one of the other services, your arms dealer, things like grenades and C4. As Lincoln goes through the game, obviously picking up money, he stores it in his wallet, but if you were to die at some point, then you would lose a significant chunk of that cash. So we have a service through one of the underbosses, and this is called the Consigliere, so you can kind of call this driver in who comes and picks up money from you and then stores that in a safe location. So you want to keep doing that uh, throughout the game so that you make sure when you die you're not going to lose all of your money because that could be potentially quite a big hit depending on how long you've been uh, stashing it for.